Here we're looking at Emerson AMS software, which we're going to use to interrogate the Foundation Field Bus transmitter that's connected to our Delta V system. If we navigate the AMS tree structure here, we see that we have the I.O. system, the Delta V I.O., and a field bus card, card number two, and connected to that field bus card we have pressure transmitter 501, which happens to be an Emerson Rosemount 3095 multivariable transmitter. The first block that comes up in this transmitter as we interrogate it through AMS is the resource block describing what the transmitter is doing and uh, alarms it may have, options uh, whether we suppress or enable alarms, we can simulate alarms here. Also it has three transducer blocks. The first transducer block is used for interpreting the direct process variables. Now remember this is a multivariable transmitter, so it measures differential pressure, which we see right here. It also measures uh, static pressure, and it measures process temperature. These variables are useful when we go to calculate true mass flow for gas through a pipe, such as for the AGA, American Gas Association Standard Number 3 calculations. If we go to the next transducer block, this is where we actually calculate mass flow rate. And so it takes in the process variables, differential pressure, static pressure, process temperature. We tell it what sort of fluid is going through it. In this case, natural gas is the default fluid. And we give us some other information, the, the orifice plate bore diameter, the orifice plate material, uh, the meter tube material, the meter tube diameter, and it will then go through the appropriate calculations to figure out mass flow rate. And we also give it ranges here. The third transducer block is for the local display. This particular transmitter happens to have a local display where an operator can look at the transmitter in the field and see a variety of readings, including the mass flow rate as calculated by the transmitter. So transducer block 1300 right here is where we configure parameters for that display. This is something you'll see in all field bus instruments as a resource block and one or more transducer blocks representing inputs, outputs, and certain calculations uh, resonant within that instrument.